Ben <laughs> is actually, you guys should know, Ben Dubard. Ben Dubard is a soccer referee and a big soccer fan. And we have a huge soccer team. fan. Huge soccer fan. Huge soccer fan. If you're not following him on Twitter, at Ben Dubard, uh, we have Dorking Wanderers FC have a sponsorship announcement. Let's hear the sponsorship announcement, Ben. <laughs> Get this stuff. <laughs> Dorking Wanderers. I've never heard such a brilliant name for a for a football club or soccer let's team. Let's take a listen. A massive welcome to Hex, and uh, we're delighted to announce a significant long-term partnership with Hex. Hex are one of the world's leading crypto currency companies, and similar to Dorking Wanderers, which is why this partnership is so ideal, but a massive upward trajectory and fastest growing company of their type across the world. So really appreciate um, all the boys at Hex getting behind the Wanderers. I'm sure the Wanderers will get behind Hex and both Q Unique Beach World will work together and most of all appreciate all of their efforts supporting us at the club. So check them out, Hex. They're a big ticket like the Wanderers. Roll well, us a massive welcome to Hex. There you go. <laughs> Forget it loops. Ben, what is your take on the dorky want the dorking wanderers <laughs> being sponsored by hex.com that's cool man i i don't think it's going on the jersey like it was with barnsley which is a which i wish it was because i i really wanted to get the barnsley kit when uh wait 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 wait, wait what oh it is oh oh dude no way i didn't that's see that. right that's right are we getting the kit now i'm i'm gonna have to man i have i have uh yeah i'm gonna have to get one like that's awesome. That's very cool. So it is funny. I think he called it a company in the in the clip. He was like, Hex is a great <laughs> company. <laughs> but yeah, that's cool, man. And I've seen there were hex ads on like the side, like the things that uh ring the soccer field. There were like hex sponsorships in Premier League games before. I think it's on the hex website. Like they have those posts. Yeah, no, they they, they had cool. they sponsored a, a team and then like they got they got it taken down because People said they were they were a scam or something like that. There was a whole there was a whole fallout, but they actually did get it was like one of these random teams in uh, in, in England, I think in, in Manchester or something. And uh Honestly. And, and there was and, and they were getting like nobody ever heard of them, and then all of a sudden they get the hex logo on their jersey and everyone's talking about it. They get huge social media engagement. Um, and the there was actually a fundraiser for the uh, the hometown for that uh, for that team, a charity fundraiser, and like Hexkins donated. Yeah, like I remember thousands that. Yeah. And thousands of dollars. And what do we get in return? <laughs> they lost the sponsorship. That was that was very sad. Hopefully that's that not going to happen with the, with the working wanderers. But... <laughs> yeah, that whole thing was ridiculous. I remember that. <laughs> it didn't make any <laughs> sense. I'm pretty sure Richard Hart was like criticizing like. The treatment of gay people in saudi arabia and they like misconstrued his tweet as like insulting gay people and he was like what <laughs> so i it, yeah didn't really make much sense yeah yeah 